Hi everybody! Today we're going to be talking about improving your language learning capability by doing the same thing you did when you were in first grade. And that's, we're going to look at beginning reader books. Now I have four beginning reader books. This is a National Geographic Kids series, but they're in German. So this is Dinosauria, Planeten, Haya, and Vala. Uh, and you can get um, books like these, beginning readers, from your favorite vendor. So you can try your online vendor, your favorite bookstore vendor of choice, and you can see if they do have beginning reader books yeah, in your target language. And this, these are German, but they could be French, Italian, Chinese. And just take a look. And Now what's great about beginning reader books is they purposely are made for kids that are just learning how to read. And uh, what this means is it's got two things going for it. One is the sentences are simple but they're also for a native audience. These aren't uh, textbooks that were, uh, or workbooks that were made for people who are, in this case, learning German. These are books that National Geographic Kids made to be sold to native German speakers uh, who are children learning to read German. So if you were to read these, you are now reading a book that was made to be read by a native speaker in their language at the beginning reader level. The other thing that's going that goes good for uh, beginning readers is they are purposely meant to be high interest. And all these these are nonfiction books, and of course they're beginning readers that are stories. But uh, these ones, um, just because what I'm interested in, planets, planetin, dinosauria, dinosaurs, vala, whales and Haya, so sharks. Um, when you read these kinds of books, you will start to pick up on actual phrases. You're going to improve your vocabulary just like you would have if you were learning to read when you were in first grade. Lots of you probably used these, you know, in the United States we have the, the step into reading books, um, and they have the little levels on here. So this is level two. This is the whale book is level three. The dinosaur one is one. So you can start with level one and you get through this and you can read it a few times and that's how you really start to get the, the how the sentences are formed. You pick up the vocabulary and you also get how, just how naturally sentences go. And then you can jump up to level two. And then once you get comfortable with level two, you can jump up to a level three. So the publisher has done a lot of the work for you. It said, here's a level one book, simple vocabulary, simple sentences. Here's level two, and then here's level three, and it's more complex. And then once you get comfortable with the level three, you can then, just like you would have when you were in elementary school, once you got comfortable going through beginning reader books, once you get into that second grade, third grade level, you can then move into chapter books in your target language. Great way to improve your vocabulary and how to form sentences in your target language that you're learning. Do what you did in first grade. Get those beginning reader books, start at level one. Once you're comfortable with level one, go to level two. Once you're done with level two, go to level three. Once you've done a couple beginning reader books and you're comfortable, jump up to chapter books. All right, have a good day. Thank you so much for joining us.